Hi everyone, I think my mustache is coming along quite nicely for my play, that's Fiddler on the Roof. If you happen to be in Toronto on the weekend of, or the week of April 21st through 23rd, there's going to be two shows on the 23rd, a matinee and an evening performance, uh, come see me at the Fairview Library Theatre. Anyway, on to why I actually made this video. So, I've been doing a lot of movie reviews lately. Uh, you can check out some of them on the fatoverlords.com. Otherwise, if you know who I am on Facebook, you can find them there. But, in association with the upcoming Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice movie, I still hate that title. I do think Bat Ben Affleck is a pretty good choice for Batman, but we'll see if the movie's actually any good. As a lot of you know, I did not like Man of Steel, but I'm getting off topic. In association with that upcoming movie, there have been a lot of tie-ins. One that I did not expect to see, but yet I should not be surprised that I saw... Superman Serial. And, of course, the competing... Batman cereal. So I thought, you know, I'd pick up a box of each and actually see which one of these I prefer. Now, I have not tried these yet, so I have no idea if I'll actually like either of them. But they were on sale, so I figured, why not? I'll see if I actually like them. Probably should have gotten something to uh, actually cut up in the thing. Anyway, so I'm going to start with the Superman one. And this is a Caramel Crunch cereal. And it actually does smell a, a fair bit like caramel. So I'm just going to be uncouth and pop a few of them in my mouth here. There. Let's see if I can get this to focus on these. Roughly in the shape of the Superman symbol. There's nothing actually printed on them, so you can't really say it is a Superman symbol. It's more like a triangle, but... It's crunchy. If I was to compare that to anything, it's kind of like corn pops, a little bit crunchier, not quite as much air in them, and actually not quite as strange as it sounds, not quite as sweet as corn pops, but definitely does have the caramel flavor to them. Actually, it's not bad at all. Yeah, I stand by that assessment. It's corn pops, less sweet, uh, but with a more caramel flavor. Anyway, yeah, so those aren't bad. Let me just quickly, roughly seal this up. And now, let's try the Batman one. These are chocolate and strawberry. This one, I think I'm going to like more, but we'll see. Ooh, just opening the bag, just an immediate, right in my face, strawberry smell. It's like the artificial strawberry, but still very recognizably strawberry. I'm not getting any... No, I'm not getting any chocolate, but then again, chocolate doesn't really have that much of a smell, per se, unless it's hot chocolate. Hmm. And again, of course, the, these are definitely more bat-shaped. Definitely recognizably a bat. Anyway, here we go. Well, there's an initial hit of the strawberry, but as I said, it tastes very artificial. And then the chocolate flavor 
I'm not sure if any of you have actually done this. I, I've done it. I don't, I'm not afraid to admit it. Ever take that hot chocolate powder and just eat it directly? It kind of tastes like that. It's not really... You know what? I don't like this. I mean, I bought the thing. I'll finish it. Maybe it tastes better with milk, but... It's like strawberry quick mixed with chocolate quick. That's what this tastes like. And I, I thought the combination would work well together because I love chocolate-covered strawberries, but th this is kind of disgusting. Oh. Oh, I'm going to need some water after this. Uh, yeah, so, sorry. Superman ones all the way. Uh, yeah. All right, well, this is a random video, but what are you going to do? I'll talk to you folks later. I hope this was fun.